We're here today in June 2016 with Dr. Michael Gramley. He has an exciting new project he's going to tell us about. Uh, today I have here before us uh, a group of, a uh, very exciting group of artifacts from the Bowser Road Mastodon site in the classic uh, county of Orange County in the Hudson Valley in New York State. These were excavated uh, uh, in 2014 and then again in 2015. Uh, we found a bull mastodon uh, aged 55 to 65 years who had been perhaps killed, but certainly butchered. And we found 69 uh, minimum count of bones that have been chopped up uh, with an ax. Uh, and among the, the fragmented skeleton, we found a number of important artifacts but none so important as these here. Uh, I might draw your attention, first of all, to this uh, quartzite boulder with a very sharp ridge on it. Uh, this was found uh, among, uh, these artifacts lay among and around this uh, quartzite rock uh, in a, uh, what was probably at one time a frozen lake uh, where this mastodon had come to rest. Uh, but I will argue that this rock uh, was used to, uh, in a very important way, to break down uh, the artifacts, uh, uh, to uh, fragment the artifacts that we have here. Uh, one of these artifacts I'll draw your attention to uh, is um, this completed one. This is a uh, piece of mastodon rib that has been very cleverly split and shaped uh, into this very regular uh, uh, lath of bone. You'll also notice that it has a, a V notch at one end uh, broken on one of the wings. There are many of these uh, pieces of mastodon bone that have V notches. Uh, and uh, here's another one I think you can see. We have uh, five or six with these notches on the end. Uh, this, uh, I believe, is an addle addle. Um, it, it was made for uh, casting javelins. Uh, it's optimal length for an atlatl, about 24 inches long. Uh, we have evidence uh, that there are 16 of these atlatls that were broken and deposited at this site. These boxes are fragments of, of, of these atlatls awaiting restoration. I've only managed to put a few of these uh, back together. But I draw, I'll draw your attention to the, to not only to the V-notching on one end, but also notice the fracturing that is occurring here. It's very regular. Uh, this is called green stick fracturing, uh, which occurs when the bone uh, is uh, fresh, uh, probably during uh, the, when the Clovis uh, people broke, uh, broke these things. And uh, it certainly wasn't created by us. Uh, the bone would not break like this if it were a modern fracture. But in any case, here's a, a one that's complete. And now there's another uh, one that I have here, probably the same rib anatomically uh, in the animal. It's broken up a little bit more, but you can see the length is comparable. It's a little bit longer. Uh, but again, fractured also very regularly, probably fractured by uh, breaking it over this uh, 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 anvil stone. Now. Uh, these uh, addle addles, uh, I might tell you, are the only, uh, the first known Clovis addle addles. Uh, people have hypothesized that addle addles were used to cast javelins to bring down animals, but uh, I'd say here's the proof of it. 